All right, if you are looking to adopt a pet, the Humane Society in Memphis and Shelby County has you covered. I am with Leonard Tisha, who has brought a very, very special, super cute. I mean, how cute is this dog? Who is this? This is Letitia. Okay. And Letitia is 13 years old, mm -hmm. and she found her way to us in kind of a sad story mm -hmm. that uh, the owner that loved her very much, and Letitia loved her owner very much, Unfortunately, her health started declining mm -hmm. and had to go into a convalescent home okay. and Letitia could not go with her. Aww. So it was a very emotional day that day that they had to part her ways. And 13 years old, she was very sad for days, but she's starting to get over that a little bit mm -hmm. and come out of her shell. But we just really want to get her into a home. She's very, very loving, as you can yeah. tell. But she's also active. She's okay. been running around and playing with everybody with the, com the comedians that were here just sitting yeah, there playing sure with was. them and she's been playing with folks in the studio so so she's active but but she just needs that very that not that soft place to land to live out her her golden years so the t uh, type of home you think would be good probably a, a more calm home okay. not as much with the small children mm -hmm. uh this would make someone that's also a senior a, a, a very good pet to, okay. to have what sort of um, fees and things are associated with this? So uh, with our pets, all our pets come spayed or neutered. Right. There, are, there are vaccines and their microchip, which is very important. Yeah. You know, if they're lost, that's the way you get your pet back. So our adoption fees go from fifty to uh, fifty to one hundred fifty dollars. She mm -hmm. is a senior, so there is a discount there. Okay. And uh, and so uh, we really really want to get her quickly out of a shelter environment. Yeah. One, because she's so small, right. and most dogs in a shelter are bigger, mm -hmm. and even though they don't interact with each other like that, we're not going to allow such a big dog to play with a small yeah. dog. It's still very noisy for them. For sure. So we want to get her into, into a home as quick as we can. Yeah, I have a feeling she will be in a home very, very quickly. We hope so. I know it's also a very busy season for you all. Y'all have a 5K coming up, and you said it's a uh, Puppy and kitten season. Yes, puppy and kitten season is here early, mainly because it's been so warm this winter, and uh, we're oh, getting be overwhelmed. Yeah. So. If you really want to open up your home to fosters, then go to our website and click on uh, volunteer opportunities and uh, and become a foster. We supply everything. The only thing you need to do is open your home up and give them some love. Okay. We supply the food, the medicines, the crate, the bowls, blankets, toys, everything. It is that easy. Okay, yes. so you heard all that. And if you want more information on how to adopt a pet, uh, you can visit MemphisHumane.org and click on the Adopt a Pet tab. There will also be information about that 5K that they have coming up in just a few weeks.